Hello there, this is Name. Since I'm going to study computer science beginning in October, I was doing some programming stuff lately. And it turns out that you can convert basic Java code into Minecraft command functions, all vanilla. So I took the RSA algorithm and remade it inside Minecraft. But before I'm going to show you how to use the functions, I will be giving you a short explanation of what it is doing. Actually, there are a lot more scoreboard objectives and functions, but these are the ones you need to use and understand it. First of all, you set your RSA encode score to the value you want to encrypt. Then you need two keys, set RSA P1 and RSA P2 to a prime number you like. They have to be prime numbers though. Now the RSA encode function can use those two keys to encrypt the input score. The output is stored in the same objective RSA encode. To get back the original number you have to copy the value of RSA encode to the objective RSA decode and run the function of the same name. It is quite similar to the encode function. And the important thing is you only get back the original number if you still use the same two keys. Let me show you how to use it in Minecraft. Here you can select your keys, after that you have to run the setup function, it's just doing some technical stuff in the background. Now we are ready to send secret messages. Therefore I made this keyboard, every letter is represented by a number, starting at 2 because 1 always decodes to 1 again. That means 2 is A, 3 is B, 4 is C, 5 is D and so on. When you right click assign it will set your input score and activate the encoding function. In chat it will display the original number and the encrypted one. This command block will transfer the value of RSA encode to RSA decode and run the decryption function after a short delay. That way you can see what's going on on the sidebar. Alright, that's it for this video. If you want to test this mechanic yourself, you can find the download link in the description. And in case you want to use these functions in your own world, simply move the functions folder to your world file and execute the following commands.